Yo, what's up? Fears to fathom. I didn't realize this was an actual real life event that happened to someone. So Home Alone, I, I already played it. That's interesting. So now let's start with Norwood Hitchhike. Episode two, Norwood Hitchhike, June 16. Oh shit, here we go. This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help even if it's just a little bit. I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. I'd go to every convention I get the chance to, and sometimes even met, meet some of my online friends. Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives, but a plane ticket would have been too expensive. Oh shit, a drive. This convention I was at went great. It always happens when you're trying to save money, you know? And it was now the day I drive back home. But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over 12 hour drive. Oh my God. That's crazy. Oh my goodness. Dun, 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 dun. Discord, we got ticks, so I'll see if I can get the car. Okay, this is from Aiden, Aiden Williams. We got tickets, so I'll see if I can get the car. Let you know, finally going to take Milo on a walk. Air, all right, LOL. Okay, the plans is on. Hell yes. Wait, you're getting the car? Yep. Big girl. You sure I sh can't, can't come? I'll get the skateboard too. Saw so this really cool skate park nearby. Sounds fun. Discord? Why not? Where are you? Almost there. I don't see you. Peach shirt. It was fun. I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Again, you sure driving all the way back? I don't really have a choice now, do I? I mean, you're leaving your car there. What else can you do? Could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you reach back to your cave. Okay, Dad. Not sure if it'll be this lifetime, though. What do you mean? Stuck in the biggest traffic jam of the country. That sucks. It's not too good here, either. I think it's the people from the convention. That's it. I'm rewriting here. You gotta do what you gotta do. Okay. From Papa. You called? Yeah, I think I'm going to the convention. Could I get your car for like five days, please? With who? Aiden. The internet friend? He's a nice guy, I know. You're not going on a 10 hour drive by yourself. Well, I've already made up my mind. I'll drive you. Why don't you understand any. What? Just trying to help. Let's talk when I get home. Drive safe, honey. Don't forget to call. You got her done. Aiden, anything else? Leaving now. Drive safe, Holly. Yo. Can't skip it. Whoa! What type of radio is that? Do do do. Do do do. Where did you reach? Where did you reach? It's about six hours away from the city. Got stuck in the gym. Okay. No more radio. 
come on, I wanted to sing my heart out. I'm out of gas. I realized I was the only gas. I need some gasolina. Oh shit. No, I don't want to listen to that shit. Going to run out of gas before I even get there. Told you to take, take the flight. That was no help. Oh, holy, it's going to be later when you reach back. Hope you're feeling all right. Dun. Dun. Dun, 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 dun. Who the fuck was that? Hell no, I'm out of here. Let me guess the car's going to die. Gas station. Boom. <laughs> this is how I drive. So sadness I die serious da 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 Give me some gas. Don't tell me it's on this sign. Where's my wallet? Beautiful. I like that song. Didn't want it. Wasn't feeling it. Didn't want it. What's up, my dude? How's your night going? He just looked at me. Uh oh. Is that the killer? Okay. It's from Mama Holly, your mom. Okay. Consuming this item increases your sprint stamina. How much money do I have? No, I don't want this. How much money do I have? I can get 10 on pump 2, ma'am. You heading to the bridge by yourself? The bridge? The Norwood Valley Road, I mean, not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Be careful, things. I'm not joking, man. Be careful. It's not safe out there. For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there. And people who went looking for them never return. The locals say the Norwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down on trees. Can you use the toilet? It's clean. It's not clean. You got, you got pontoon. You never know. I might need this bitch. Did I just waste it? I didn't need it. Okay. Holy fuck, I could run fast as fuck, boy. And one more thing. Oh my god. 
If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just step on the gas as hard as you can, okay? Why? Some people say that she died in a car accident there on prom night, and some say that she seeks vengeance after she was murdered there. Regardless, she's out for blood. Whatever you do, never, ever, under any circumstance, pick up a hitchhiker. Those people out there on the road putting their thumbs out, they ain't what you think, man. They're just ain't. That's some good advice. Mama, I don't know if you've, you'll find any shop at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Could you get something for Milo? I'll pay you back. Am I not going to refill? <laughs> what the fuck? That's a nice song. I like that song a lot. I feel the taking of off on the road again. I need dog food. Hopefully I have a bag, cause you know. What's in here? Nothing. Sir, what's your dog food? This is giving me the convenience store type of vibes. That'll be five dollars, ma'am. Okay, I have enough, thank God. Okay. I think we're good. The fuck? <laughs> fuck. There we go. All right, we're good. Let's go. The fuck is this? Being on the road, you do realize the thing. Monsters truly do exist. And every single one of them looks like you and me. The fuck? I think those were just cones. It's not expired or anything, right? Mama, why are you texting me when I'm the bro? What the fuck? Yeah, if you're definitely not used to driving at nighttime, this is a challenge. Especially if you've been up the entire night, the entire day. This song I would definitely listen. Oh, this is the bridge. This is a song I would definitely listen to on my own time. This would go on my beautiful playlist, 100%. Well, we passed the bridge, so... Oof, this is sketchy. This is definitely sketchy. It's only one song I was fucking with, the abandoned car, yikes. The fuck is that? <laughs> Crazy thing, I'ma get out. Fuck that.
no left turn, just keep going straight. There's this weird thing about, I saw two big logs in the middle of the, the way. Can we get out? <gasps> we can. All right. If someone had to literally put this by, I didn't think much of it. Cause we're very heavy. Jesus, you can push all that. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Alright, I'm a car guy, I know what to do. And just like that, I was trying to admit on with no phone service. Okay. Skateboard. I wouldn't be lying if I didn't feel slightly so of an ease. I didn't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but... Throughout my life, I was told not to take rides from strangers. But I had the moment, I had no choice. What do you mean? You could just... I was scared to think how long it would take for someone to pass. Can't you just fix the car? What? What are you doing? 10.23 p.m. What is she doing? I saw a car near... Bitch. Pure evil. I don't understand how someone could leave another human being stranded like that. What are you talking about? <laughs> okay. 10 43, 20 minutes later. What are you talking about? <clears throat> Oh, the car's about to die. <laughs> okay. Sketchy ass car. You're the girl from the gas station. Hi, oh, thank you so much for something. What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. I can't call for help. There's no phone service. You think I can? Oof. Where are you heading to? Just up the road. Near stop working. Hop in. Thank you so much. Hurry up. Just throw it in the bag. I won't be here for too long. What am I getting? My stuff? <laughs> he just floors it. Dun, dun. 
Let me get my stuff real quick. Be a gen- I mean, you could just be a gentleman to help me, you know? But I guess not. Okay, let me get my skateboard. I feel like that skateboard is going to come in clutch. Could use it to run faster. Hurry up, I need to get moving now, I'm done. Finally, now hop in and be quick. Oof. Oh, is that the guy that was just quiet? Or just my skateboard, I think. So you won't tell me who, who you are, where you're going around that say if that's okay. And that piece of crap broke down on me. Jason? What? My name is Jason. It's nice to meet you, Jason. Oof. This guy's creepy. You're really lucky I had to be on this side of the town tonight. I must say, you're one brave young woman. How's that? What is this? You got any clue what happened to your car back there? I think it was no, it was better. Are you sure? It's my dad's. It's pretty old. I mean, the headlights were giving out, going out. I mean. So what do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? You really creep me. He's fun. Then he's really creep. You really creep me out. I don't listen to anything more. Interesting. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. So is it true? What the monster? Let's see. I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are. There are some things. In your phrase, your car breaking down could have been one of them. Hey, listen, I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. Okay. You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not best with people. That's understandable. That's understandable. So see, twelve away, two hours. After a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Apparently, they offer roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful. There are all kinds of people out there. He yeah, ominously before leaving. Oh, is my car here? Big Mac. Now approve for occupancy? Oof. The man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Gal, need a room to shack up for the night? How much is it for a room? I'm only going to be here for you. 40 for single. Pay cash only. Room number nine, right over there. Talk about the car. 
$90, Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Damn, I'm dropping a bag. Good old tell Tommy now. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. Okay. Cool. I was too low for... Okay, let's just go. Room number nine. Oh, shit. It's not expired or anything, right, Holly? What do you mean in route? Where did you reach? Why are you not picking up the call? Well, what do you mean reroute, Dad? Must have to stay at motel tonight. You gotta do what you gotta do. Hey, where are you at? Your dad's calling me. Nine. It was nice warm inside. First things first is this call. Except there was the smell of type musky smell. Jesus, no service. Okay. What the fuck is the bed? <laughs> Couldn't have slept there. What the fuck is the bed? I didn't need that. <laughs> really? Are you fucking serious? A place I could hide, okay. Oh! What are you doing here? You scared the crap out of me. I should be asking you. I'm Tommy, room service here at Roadway in the finest stop over in Norwood. What were you doing in there? You know, cleaning stuff. Guy at the front desk gave me this room. He he, what? I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just get my stuff. What the fuck? Please wait outside. I say, go get your stuff. Oh my god. Yeah, there's cameras in there. Nah, I'm going to the front though, so I'm clean, um, complaining. Why in tarnation is there someone in there? You better have a good explanation, bitch. Your stuff is right outside. Really? Weird as dude. Hattie, what would you about the situation? What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. And also, the room's phone is not working. If you need anything, just ask the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. Hee <laughs> hee. But you have a good night. Weird ass dude. We'll see. It's pretty cool. This game is so far it's um it's based on a person's real life story. So far I'm a female that uh drove some more 12 hours away by myself and now i don't have service uh my car got stranded and yeah i'm trying to call my parents but this guy won't okay i guess so let's just go
Yeah, that guy was mad creepy. Let's see if uh, there's any cameras. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. do, do, do. Toilet paper. Okay. Get sleep now. I mean, since there's nothing else to do. <gasps> Call it foresight, but there was something very off at the, about this place. Did you not just see the dude standing there? Weird as. A hot cup of coffee would help. Okay. What was that water noise though? That's the real question. Okay, I guess let's just go. Was it distant? Cool, coffee. Consuming to stay awake. That's pretty cool. I would do this just to test it out. Oh, I could have chosen what I wanted. Oh, I was drugged. <laughs> Damn. Now we gotta get to our place. Weird ass people. Three eighteen AM I was sedated. Oof. Didn't feel safe going now. He's in here. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh my god. That is foul. Ah, uh, don't tell me how to start all over again. Thank God. Jesus fucking. Oh my God. I don't know what to do. Can't go answer the door.
man, this is disturbing. Oh shit, am I going to get kidnapped now? Jesus Christ. Okay, what am I supposed to do now? What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, he's at my door. Hell no. Hell no. Got me fucked up. First time of defense, get a weapon. No, get the weapon. Yeah, we'll use this. This is so weird. This is making me feel uncomfortable. And now we wait. We wait for that dude. Oh, wait, no, he takes a picture, yeah, he takes a picture. So fucking creepy. Who is that?
Oh my god. Am I supposed to interact with them? I think I am supposed to interact with them. That is so fucking creepy, dude. Well, there's nothing else I can do. Is that me waking up, trying to wake up? I could do it again. Okay, well, I can't do anything else. I need your help, please. Please open the door. I know you're in there. Here we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, I think it's about to start. I think I, I need to initiate him going crazy at the door. <sighs> My heart is fucking pounding. <laughs> yeah, I, I need to initiate it. I just need to talk to you. I swear I'm not a comp. Please go away. I'm going to call the comps. Pretty lady.
to the family really weird that the manager interfered in not to go to the police while that was able to affect the Mattel's reputation and of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something even worse. Jesus Christ. Tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year. Oh my god, that was the most immersed I've ever been in a game. I never want on um, long road trips again. I would have always I would always take airplanes. Damn, this is a good ass game. Oh my god. Okay, that's the that's the ending song. Oh my god. I felt like I was gonna get R <laughs> <sighs> Damn, this and this was just three fucking dollars. Outstanding game, outstanding developers. I'll de I'm definitely going to check out more of their shit. God. My fucking heart, dude. Okay, so. I was R one time when I drank the coffee. But then there's another person? So it was multiple people Ring everyone. That's weird. That's fucking weird. 